Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the WWE exclusive announcement. This is where we will go over any announcements regarding my Ruthless Aggressionary Universe mode. And we're going to kick things off with what happened in the last episode of Friday Night Smackdown heading into the Judgment Day pay-per-view. As we saw the debut of the alpha male Monty Brown. Monty Brown has been officially signed to Friday Night Smackdown. He put up one hell of a fight against the former undisputed champion, The Undertaker. Although he was unsuccessful, it was still one hell of a debut for the alpha male. And he was approached backstage later in that night and was asked what he thought of his WWE debut and what his plans are for Friday Night Smackdown, and this is what he had to say. Well, Monty Brown seemed very excited to be a part of the Friday Night Smackdown roster. I personally am excited. I hope you guys are as well. And on top of that, I can leave you with one final note regarding the alpha male. He has guaranteed that he will be at the Judgment Day pay-per-view in some sort of capacity. What is he going to be doing exactly? We are not sure, but we do know this. The alpha male will be at the Judgment Day pay-per-view. And speaking of the Judgment Day pay-per-view, we have one other announcement regarding one of the matchups on that card. It's set to be Mr. Kennedy versus Kurt Angle, and it has brought to the attention to Vince McMahon that with the amount of hostility between these two competitors, there's only one way that their rivalry can be settled, so he has decided to make their matchup at Judgment Day a no disqualification match. It's going to be one hell of a contest. I can't wait for it. I hope you guys can't wait as well. And to round things out here today, I also bring you some news surrounding the beast Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar has been injured since WrestleMania. There has been no signs of him coming back, but rumors have started to stir up in recent weeks that Brock Lesnar may be making a return at the Judgment Day pay-per-view. Paul Heyman and Bobby Lashley have yet to comment on that. We're hoping to get some comments at the Judgment Day pay-per-view, but as of right now, nothing is confirmed, but there are rumors going around that Brock Lesnar may be returning at Judgment Day. And that's everything that's happening in my Ruthless Aggression Universe mode thus far. I hope you guys did enjoy this. Make sure you keep your eye out for the Judgment Day pay-per-view that is in the works and that should be finished here in the next couple days. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thank you all so much for joining me. And I'll catch you all next time.